Okay, everybody. So welcome to uh, the Sunday Seasonal Mind Games. I'm Ruan, I'm the founder of Seasonal Tokens, and I'm here with Andy and Tears. The idea of the game is that you need to choose the least popular season. So uh, we'll, we'll go through five, uh, five rounds of the game. Everybody will see how it works. And uh, it's a lot of fun. Everybody who gets the least popular season is going to get some magic. So, um, yeah, if you are wanting to hang out and you've got um, some free time on a Sunday, definitely would advise to come in. It's a good laugh. And what I love about it is uh, it doesn't require uh, any level of skill. You literally just need to pick one of the four seasons, which obviously we'll go through. Um, and at the end of it, you have a chance to win some free matic. So ready when you are, Rowan. OK, let's go. I'm starting game one now. OK, the game has started. Now you have everybody has 60 seconds to get in and I am going to choose a season. For anybody that's looking at the screen now, you can see obviously the bots pinged up and it's showing four seasons. Uh, for the people that are visible, and you can do this by literally using slash visible, and then it means that every time uh, we make a command, so you'll see the likes of myself, Rowan, um, you can see what we chose. Some people do this to try and make people think that, you know, you've made a move um, and obviously they'll copy you or do something different. So sometimes it can be a deliberate... Um, wanting to be visible. So you'll see at the minute, we've got winter with the lowest amount of votes and spring with the highest. So if the game was to end right now, anybody that's in winter would would be getting a point. So obviously this is five rounds um, and this is the first game of the five. So you'll see it's popping up now because people are constantly making an alteration in terms of what they're choosing. And you can do this as many times as you like. Absolutely. Now we've got to an interesting state. Spring is really overcrowded. Uh, I think there's going to be a flood of people away from spring. Everybody knows that spring is not going to win if all these people stay in spring. And winter is looking like a, a, an attractive choice right now. Uh, what we would anticipate is looking at this. If you're new or looking in, obviously, on this from the YouTube video, you're kind of thinking, well, you're going to move to winter. The problem is if everybody does that, winter's going to end up with a high score. So you're kind of judge. You're trying to judge what people are going to do right at the last second. Um, and you'll see that uh, cho choices can only be changed now for the last 15 seconds and then it will nine seconds now and then it, the bot will play out for the final 30 so right now it's a tie between summer and winter um so it's kind of people making that decision do they want to move or do they want to stay so what did you guys settle on in the end well, well where are you andy i stayed in summer i okay. i uh, i went with i went with summer i mean the game that we played this morning spring was overloaded massively so i think psychologically people have had time to calm down had some dinner i think they're going to come back and they're going to go well there's no way spring's winning again so i took that into uh, consideration for this game in particular and i've got it wrong what the hell oh my god Ooh, well, Only summer's... a few seconds left. Summer, summer's looking summer's like it. it could win. Summer's got it. Angry Dragons oh. won. Yeah, summer's got it. Yep, summer. Summer. Aye, uh, well done, Angry Dragon. Boom. Okay, look at this. Okay, Hemby and Leo got four out of five. Congratulations. Wow. And, wow. Uh, yeah. That, that's uh, that's hard to do because it does involve some psychology. So, um, yeah, congratulations to everybody who's there on the scoreboard. And uh, now I will pay out the prizes. So let me have a look at these uh, commands here. Ooh. Really good part. Really good timing again. We've literally hit it on the half hour. So for anybody that's watched this, we normally do wrap up five rounds in about thirty minutes. So the good thing is it's not too long. That thirty minute mark's kind of like the threshold for people. Um, same as uh, if anybody's watching this YouTube video back. That thirty minutes is kind of like oh yeah, it's over. So um, anybody that wants to play, it's it's nice and quick. Fantastic. Take care, everybody. Sounds good. Goodbye, guys. Thank you for joining. See you All later. Right. Bye. See ya.